Nice hustle last few weeks. Thank you, Triple H. I appreciate your compliment. Triple H, hey, appreciate that. I could tell you were stressed out for a while there, but you look but you took off like a bullet. Only did what I had to. You know me, you know how I do's in the ring. Trips. That's all we can ever do, huh? Anyways, pretty big month. It is a it has been a big month. You're right. Over the next weeks, we're planning to decide who's going to be in the Money in the Bank match. Triple H giving your boy a heads up. I've been looking forward to this milestone, Trips. You and an army of superstars. Yeah, but those superstars aren't me, though. Those superstars aren't me. I'm telling all the guys the same thing, and I'm telling you now. All right. Every show this week is crucial in deciding who will be in that match. Uh, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Every match is a big deal to me. I take that as an ever so slight affront. I treat every match as a big deal. I don't know who you think you're talking to. Some matches matter more than others. You know that. Uh, that's true. That's true. Still, my fans are rooting for me whenever I'm out there. I'm conscious of that fact. Goes without saying then. Be on top of your game all month long. Understand? I got you. I got you. I hear you. Won't let you guys down. I never let anybody down. I'm a GOAT. Undefeated. Greatest. Never been pinned. Never been submitted. All right, so, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of WWE 2K18, my career featuring the Sin City St. Johnny Graves. We are here, what is this, episode 23? 22? I don't even know where we're at right now. We're getting close to 25, though, and that's what's important, so we have to talk to Stephanie or Mick Foley. Of course, we are a company man, so we are going to talk to Stephanie. Miss Levesque, what's going on? I don't know. I was told to talk to you. Not much. I heard there was a small get together happening soon. It was a small little, small little gathering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, nothing big. Something called a uh, uh, money in the bank, I believe. Something like that. I don't know if you've heard of it. Yeah, yeah, and you want in. No surprise there. Well, should it be any surprise? I'm busting my ass. Uh, can you blame me? No, but I can temper you. All right, listen up. What? What now? There might be mutual interest in here. Samoa Joe is our champion, and I intend to keep it that way. I know, you told me that when I first got here. Money in the bank can be and usually is volatile. Want someone I can trust to win that briefcase. I hear you. I hear you. Um, da, 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 da. Yeah. Agreed. I call that a fair deal. Right? You are not giving me anything right now. I promise to hold on to the briefcase if you'll always remember and reward my loyalty. Oh, Johnny Graves making deals done, says Stephanie McMahon. Johnny Graves and Stephanie McMahon making deals behind the scenes. Let's say this. If you win the briefcase and you relinquish it to me, it might be beneficial to your continued future here on Raw. I gotta be honest, Steph, that sounds more like a threat than a deal. I think I can safely say the opposite in a scenario where you don't do that. Yeah, that definitely sounds like a threat. I think Stephanie McMahon is threatening us right now. Get it? Man. Got it. You betcha. You betcha. Good. We're done here. 
Yes, we are. So Johnny Graves talking to Triple H, talking to Stephanie McMahon, and he has made a deal with Stephanie McMahon. If he wins the Money in the Bank briefcase, he will relinquish it to Stephanie. That's, I don't know. I don't know if that's the greatest decision, greatest career move. Got to speak to Joe. What's up, Joe? How you doing? You just chilling out in the back by yourself? Steph filled me in on our deal, or on your deal. Yeah, what she tell you about our deal? What do you need from me? Mr. Universal Champion Samoa Joe. Here's what it is. Okay. Don't keep me in suspense. I don't want specific superstars winning the briefcase. Better to control that situation. Alright, what do you have in mind? Let me know what you're thinking. Take them down, out, whatever. Just win that briefcase. It's best for business. Understand? I hear you. I hear you loud and clear, my boy. Consider it done. Because I don't fail. Alright, so Stephanie McMahon and Samoa Joe both. Find and ambush Seth Rollins. Alright, where's Seth? Where's Seth? We got some we got some booty to whoop. Got some booty to whoop. Where you at, Seth? Where you at? Is he in the locker room? Is he in the room? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's with Seamus. He's getting backed up by Seamus. Oh! Johnny Gray's knee to the side of the head and then a stump right to the back of the neck. Johnny Gray's out of nowhere. Out of nowhere. Now he wants Seth back to his feet. Why do you want him on his feet? Keep beating him up. Ooh, quick strikes. A series of kicks and a spinning back fist and another one lifts him up. Oh my god. God, spine buster onto the floor. <laughs> Samoa Joe said he wanted these guys taken out, and Johnny Graves is doing exactly that. Gets him from behind, lifts him up. Oh, my God, lumbar check. And Seth Rollins clearly in pain now. Oh, Johnny Graves. Johnny Graves picking up a briefcase. Johnny Graves might be sending a message. No, Seth Rollins fighting back in a drop kick. Sends Graves to the floor. Now Rollins has the briefcase. Nope, he's going to miss. Johnny rolling out of the way. Big kick to the stomach. Follows it up with a series of strikes. Lifts him up and again that spine buster onto the floor. Now Johnny Graves admiring his handiwork. Feeling pumped up. Getting Rollins back to his feet. Another spinning back fist puts Seth Rollins onto the floor. Big shot to the gut and then the double knees catches him right in the mouth. This is an all-out assault. Johnny Graves, Seth Rollins had no idea that this assault was coming his way. Oh, series of strikes and then the spinning back kick right into the breadbasket. And now Graves got himself a chair. Graves looking to wear Rollins out with the chair. Catches him right on the crown of the skull. Seth Rollins is down and Seth Rollins is hurt again. Right to the... To the, to the chest, to the sternum. Rollins rolling out of the way that time. Johnny swinging at air. Rollins, oh, sends the chair right back into Graves' face. And now he's just going to launch Graves into the locker. Bouncing off those suitcases there. Oh, Johnny fighting back, though. Blocking the right hand from Rollins. And a super kick drops Rollins. And again, Graves goes right back to that steel chair. So now Graves just stands over Rollins. Wants him to get up. No, Rollins rolling out of the way of that one, but he can't avoid the second chair shot as Rollins is down and Rollins is hurt. Johnny Graves looking to continue this assault again. Rollins rolling out of the way, but again, he gets caught by that second one. You might dodge the first one, but you got to believe the second one's coming. And now again, a shot to the chest. It's Johnny Graves looking to wear Seth Rollins out. Looking to make sure that he doesn't even make it to money in a bank. Money in the bank, whatever. Big shot here. Pump handle, suplex onto the floor. Right onto the back of the neck, back of the head, and Johnny's going to taunt now. There's no fans. No one's seeing this. Well, they might be seeing it on the Titan Tron, but it's not like he's in front of the fans right now. But he's going to taunt anyway as Seth Rollins fights yeah. back. Johnny may be wasting too much time. And again, Rollins sends Graves bouncing off that 
the wood of that those lockers. Big right hand from Rollins, and again he's gonna send him into the lockers. Yeah. Nope, missing the right hand there. Rollins hooks the arm, gets him up. No knee to the head. Johnny Graves fighting out of it. Johnny Graves, what's he got in mind now? Lifts him up. Oh man, the Star Killer. Star Killer. And he's not dead yet. He's not dead yet. Oh my, this is ridiculous. Johnny Graves now gonna throw Seth Rollins out of the room. Oh man, and the rocket kick catches Seth Rollins clean in the chest. Seth Rollins is in trouble here. Once again, hooks the arm, gets him up. Star Killer! And Seth Rollins is done. Seth Rollins is done for security now. Too little, too late, security guards. Three and a half stars. It was great. We earned 448 VC. 6,450 total match score. It's pretty good for a quick little backstage brawl. All right, so it looks like now we're going to talk to our boy Todd Mullins. What's up, Todd? Starting things off loudly, aren't you? Are you, you heard that? You heard that little scuffle? My bad. I tried to be quiet. I tried to be quick and quiet about it. Oh, you heard that. I know I said that already. The WWE Universe heard that, man. Pretty brutal beating you gave him. Renee is unsurprisingly raring a chat with you about it. Why don't you go give her a sound bite or two? I can do that. I can do that. Absolutely. Absolutely. You want me to talk to Renee about the butt whooping I gave Seth Rollins? I can do that. I, oh, there's boxes. All these boxes in my way. Somebody get these boxes out of my way so I can go talk to Renee. All these boxes just stacked up all over the place. Come on now. Oh, what now? Welcome what back to the show. This is my guest Let's tonight, the one and only, the Sin City Saint Johnny Graves. That attack came out of nowhere. Did he do something to you? What was your reason for that? Oh, Renee, you little minx. This is what's best for business, whether that's for my business or the company's. That will never, or that will have to be left for your own analysis. But what I will say is this: I have particular interest in seeing certain outcomes here in the WWE. Most of the time, I'm towing the line as per what helps the company. Others, I'm in the ring seeking a certain something for myself. Either way, I'm here to keep things entertaining and moving along. That just about sums it there you up. have it. Back to and you guys. You Thanks, Talk Renee. Appreciate the time. All right. Exit the arena by talking to the parking lot attendant. I guess we are done for week one of June. But before we get out of here, let's go talk to Paul Heyman. Paulie Dangerously. You got anything new to say? He deserved that. We all know it. Thank you, Paul. Thank you so much for making me not feel guilty about beating up Seth Rollins. The truth is, I like Seth Rollins. I love Seth Rollins. I have nothing but respect for Seth Rollins. He's one of my favorites. He's one of my favorites. But, you know, you got to do what you got to do sometimes. When Stephanie says jump, sometimes you got to say, uh, yeah, maybe later. I'm kind of full of jello right now. Anyway, let's get to week two. All right, week two of June. And once again, we got to talk to Samoa Joe. Hey, I talked with Steph, and she's putting you in a two-on-one handicap match against Roman Reigns, the big dog. It's our chance to prove ourselves against a top WWE talent. A man who's been hand chosen. Looks like the ball is moving. Moving in the favor of Johnny Graves and Samoa Joe. Make sure you keep pushing it and don't mess this up for me. You have the advantage here. I know I have the advantage here. What are you talking about? Leave me alone, Joe. Why you got... Man, it may seem so dramatic. Come on. You can count on me. Johnny Graves definitely seems like he's uh, fully, undeniably aligned himself with uh, Stephanie McMahon and Samoa Joe here tonight. Well, I, I guess not tonight. I guess it's been going on for the last few weeks. Speak to Todd Mullen at the production area. All right, Toddy boy. My main man, Todd. What's good? You know the plan tonight? You know the deal. A lot is riding on this match. Okay, you are aware. 
you are fully aware of what is about to go down tonight. Story of my life. All I do is win, 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 no matter what. A lot is riding on this match. I know, Todd, you just said that, bro. You just, you literally just told me that. Yeah, I know. I heard you. God, can I just, can I go to the ring now? Can I please just go to the ring now? I understand that a lot is riding on this. Stephanie wants me to win. Wants me to beat up Roman. Samoa Joe wants me to win. Wants me to beat up Roman. May have heard me, but I don't think you're listening. Well, there is a big difference between hearing and listening, Todd, but I'm listening. Got yourself a powerful, no, scratch that, an influential tag partner in tonight's match. Oh, who am I teaming up with? Am I teaming up with Triple H himself? Because he's influential. Is that who? Is that who I'm teaming up with? Now, that could mean a new dependable ally who's got your back. I like the sound of that. I like the sound of that. Most certainly is. That's a good thing. Johnny's a little late. Already saying this stuff. Uh, could also mean you're in his pocket. Oh, I, I am in no one's pocket, good sir. Good sir. I may align myself with Samoa Joe. Next week, I align myself with John Cena. The next week, I'll align myself with Roman Reigns. And the next... Anyway. Uh... All in all, the only thing I'm telling you is to go into this with your eyes open. You're juggling some fire. Might be a can of gasoline in the mix as well. I, I, I hear you. I hear you, Todd. But like I was saying, I will align with anyone from one week to the next to do whatever is best for me. Because what's best for me is what's best for business. Don't worry about it. I'm always keeping my eyes peeled. Todd, I always know what's going on. Always. Get your opponent to red limb damage, win the match. All right, yeah, I can do that. Easy, easy. I'll see you in a few minutes, Todd. Ladies and gentlemen, look at that. Look at who Johnny Graves' tag team partner is. None other than the universal champion himself, Samoa Joe, Graves and Joe teaming up to take on the big dog in a two-on-one handicap match. Fans on their feet. They are excited. Roman Reigns, Johnny Graves, Samoa Joe on the other end of the ring. And Roman Reigns, it looks like we're ready to do I don't think he guys. even understands what he's and gotten himself into as Johnny takes him down. Oh, and then a big stomp onto the elbow. Johnny Graves focusing on that arm right away. Right off the bat. And again, oh, big stomp to the elbow. So clearly, Johnny Graves focusing in on that on that right arm of Roman Reigns, which is, if you, oh, big knee to the stomach. I was going to say, if you think about it, it's smart. You take away that right hand. You take away Roman Reigns' power. You take away his ability to use the Superman punch. But right now, Johnny Graves and Roman Reigns going back and forth right now. Roman, no. John, I was going to say Roman getting the advantage, but Johnny's slipping out. Oh, big reverse DDT. Once again, Johnny. Johnny, as arrogant as ever, going to take the time to play to the crowd, taunt a little bit, sends Reigns into the ropes, catches him. Oh, both boots right up under the jaw. And Roman Reigns is down. Roman Reigns is hurt. You can be sure. The man who's part of the Samoan dynasty. Oh, misses the kick, though. The fight with Roman Reigns, no. Johnny fighting out. Looked like he was going for a belly-to-belly -belly suplex, but Graves, no. Reigns with a jawbreaker coming back now. Back and forth, these two go. As Roman Reigns, what a slam. Absolutely plants. And now just vicious, vicious right hands right to the, to the forehead, to the bridge of the nose. Roman Reigns, big right hand here. Oh, and then a headbutt. My God. Roman, chill. Chill out, man. Chill out, man. Take a chill pill. Johnny Graves getting out, though. Fighting back. Oh, my God. Neck breaker right across the knee. And then again, going right back to the arms. Right back to the arms of Roman Reigns. And again, for the second time in a row, Johnny Graves attacking that arm. Oh, then a big stomp right to the head. No, Roman rolls out of the way of that one. 
Spinning back fist now sends Reigns into the corner. Oh, and Johnny Graves going to take his time getting over there. Has him though. What's this? Big scoop slam. Graves up to the middle rope. Elbow drop right to the sternum. Once again, Graves zeroing in on that arm, on that right arm of Reigns. They want Reigns to have red limb damage. I will break Roman Reigns' arm. I am not. And then again, again, just the, the arrogance, the cockiness of the Sin City Saint. Oh, big roundhouse kick right to the small of the back. Sends Reigns to the canvas. Oh, big knee, though. Reigns fighting back. Johnny wisely rolling out of the ring. Doesn't want Roman Reigns to build any momentum, Just but Roman's going to follow him out. There. Oh, and a big, oh man, what a combo. Series of shots there from Graves, capping it off with a spinning back kick and then a kick to the leg. Oh, and a super Just kick catches Reigns clean the on the here. jaw. Oh, Roman, Roman Reigns might be out. Johnny breaking up the referee's count. Can't win by, can once again. Once again, going after the arm of Roman Reigns. And again, Johnny just focusing in on that arm, zeroing in on it. Once he's again, Graves back into now. the ring. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. What's Graves got in mind here? Is he going to tag in Joe? Is Graves going to make a tag? Roman Reigns slow to get to his feet. Referees counts up to six now. Got to get back in the ring. Seven. We might just have a count out on our hands. Roman Reigns doesn't want to get counted out here tonight, although it might back be good for him because he won't get his arm broke if he gets counted out. Johnny Graves, big right hand. Whips Reigns into the ropes. Oh, no. They bump heads. Reigns gains the advantage, though. Sends Graves into the ropes. Lifts him up. No, Graves slipping He's free. Big kick to the back of the knee. Backbreaker. Transitions right into the side Russian leg sweep. Beautiful combination there from Graves. And once again, the young man, once again, showing these fans that he is in firm control of this matchup. Gets Reigns back to his feet. No, big block and then a left hand. Catches Graves, right hand, rocks him. Lifts him up in the electric chair drop. Plants Graves, but Graves, though, quickly getting back to his feet here as Reigns helps him. Oh, big right hand takes him down. Reigns has a comeback. I don't know. Oh, there he is. I was going to say, I don't know if he's going to use it. Series of clotheslines now from Reigns, and a big clothesline drops Graves. Oh, Superman punch. He caught him. Caught him clean on the jaw. One, two. No, Samoa Joe makes the save. Johnny Graves was focused in on that. On the arms of Roman Reigns, I don't think he did enough damage because Reigns was able to get that Superman punch and Graves might have been out for a second. And the spear, no, Graves reverses it into a DDT. Out of nowhere, Graves reverses the spear into a DDT and then goes right back after the arms. Right back after the arms of Roman Reigns. Now Johnny going to get Reigns back to his feet. No, back body drop from Reigns fighting out. Johnny might need to make a tag to Joe. I don't think he's I don't think he's fully recovered here. Oh, hangs Reigns up over the top rope. I was gonna say maybe he hasn't recovered from that Superman punch, but I might be wrong. I might be absolutely wrong right now as Graves has taken firm control of this match and then again right back to the arm. Right back to attacking the arms of Roman Reigns. What's Johnny got in mind here? Nope, again. Again going after the arm and Johnny Johnny doesn't care. Johnny is not looking to put oh Oh little submission hold here from Graves looking to wear down that arm even further. I don't know if Graves really wanted Reigns to tap there. I think he was just trying to work on that arm a little bit more. Reigns now gets Johnny into the corner. Big shot right to the shoulder blades. Oh, and then launches the shoulder into the turnbuckle. No, Johnny rolling out of the way of the stomp. Johnny now sends Reigns into the corner, follows him in, double knees right to the mouth. Gonna get Reigns up, Reigns, no. Takes Johnny down. Nice arm twist there, and then an elbow right across the chest. Roman Reigns now. Back and forth match between these two. Johnny has, uh oh, uh oh, he has Johnny up. He has Johnny up. 
No, 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 no. Crucifix power bomb from Reigns. Graves might be out. Graves might be done here. Reigns not going for the cover, though. Probably should go for no. No, Roman Reigns wants the spear. Roman Reigns wants the spear, and the spear connects. Roman Reigns might have just broken Graves in half. Hooks the leg. One, two. Again, Samoa Joe with the save. Again, Samoa Joe saves Johnny Graves' life. And then he takes a big slam for his troubles. Big Michinoku driver there. Joe looks like he's a little out on his feet. Reigns gets him up. Snake eyes down across the top turnbuckle. Now Reigns rolls through. Lifts him up. The strength of Reigns right into the sit-out powerbomb. But he took his eyes off of Johnny Graves. Star killer. Star killer catches him clean on the chin. Roman Reigns fighting off Samoa Joe and took his eye off of Johnny Graves just long enough for Graves to hit the star killer. And now again, right back to the arms. Right back to the arms, looking to take out the arms, looking to injure Roman Reigns heading into Money in the Bank. But again, Roman Reigns fighting back. And the weird thing is, Johnny has a tag team partner. Johnny has Samoa Joe in his corner. Samoa Joe, oh my God, Roman Reigns sends Johnny over the top rope and to the floor. And I was saying, Samoa Joe has saved Johnny a couple of times in this match already, but Johnny not tagging Samoa Joe in, wanting to, I guess wanting to prove that he could take out Roman Reigns all by himself. You would think Johnny would take advantage of this two-on-one situation. He'd tag in Joe, he'd catch a breather, recover. But no, Johnny determined to prove that he is the future of the WWE. He is the future Believe it or not, of Raw. And quite frankly, he's out here to prove that he is the future Universal Champion. And one way to do that is definitely to take out Roman Reigns all by yourself. Although I guess we can't really say all by yourself because he did get saved by Joe a couple of times. Big right hand from Graves drops Roman immediately. Roman clearly hurt. He's clearly stunned, clearly dazed, because one right hand from Graves, and he's on the canvas, and Johnny just focusing right back on that arm. Johnny wants to, and again, again, that submission hold, looking to snap the arm of Roman Reigns as Roman fights. Roman fighting his way out. Fight, oh, knee to the back of the head, gets him out. Lifts Johnny up. Where's he taking him? Takes him to the corner. Snake eyes down into the top turnbuckle. And once again, Johnny wisely rolling out of the ring. Wisely building some spaces. Now Reigns distracted by the referee. Johnny back into the ring. Oh, and a big knee right to the stomach. Oh, Roman Reigns catches the kick, though. Dragon leg screw takes him down. Now Roman has Johnny up. Johnny, though, reversing big right hand. And the sit-out jawbreaker. Johnny Graves. Every time Roman Reigns starts to take advantage, Johnny comes right back. What's Johnny got in mind here? Oh, man. Just stomping Reigns' face right back into the canvas and then right back to the arm. Right back with the attack on the arm, the assault. Neutralizing the power, neutralizing the Superman punch. Big double axe handle. I didn't realize he had such a glass jaw. And once again, Graves playing to the crowd, taunting, letting them know that he does not fear Roman Reigns. Uh oh. He's got him again. He's got him again. Star Killer catches him for the second time tonight. And Johnny could probably pin him. No, Roman fighting back. Somehow Roman finding a second win. His right hand, uh oh, not again, not again, not again, Johnny, Johnny, why didn't you pin him, crucifix, power bomb from Reigns again, the heart, the determination of Roman Reigns, as he looks for the spear again, 
the spear again into the cover one. No, again, Samoa Joe with the save. And again, Roman Reigns going to take Samoa Joe out. Big clothesline takes Joe down. And Johnny is out. Johnny is out cold. Johnny has barely moved since taking that second spear. Roman going to taunt. Roman taunting to the crowd, and that's not a good idea as Joe goes up after him in a back suplex from the top rope. Once again, Graves lifts Reigns off the canvas and then drives his face back into the canvas again. Gets him up to his feet with Johnny got in mind here. Rocket kick catches him clean on the side of the jaw. Graves obviously exhausted, obviously beaten. Battered after the crucifix, power bombs, the spears, and again focusing on that arm. Johnny looking to just absolutely take the arms out. And again, again, Graves not going for the cover, allowing Roman Reigns desperation move to get back in this match. Reigns now lifts Johnny up. Gets, oh, nice vertical suplex there from Reigns. And this match has been absolutely it's brutal. Coming, and it's coming very soon. Absolutely brutal. Is now Reigns trapping the head, driving his elbows into the, the temple, the forehead of Johnny Graves. Over and over and over. Oh, big kick right to the spine. Roman Reigns has had multiple chances to win this match, but every single time Samoa Joe comes to the aid of Graves and a drop kick sends Reigns to the floor. Because now Samoa Joe is going to get him some. But no, Roman Reigns fighting back. Reversing with a fireman's carry on to Joe. Now Joe catches him. Big shot to the back. What's Joe got in mind here? Sends him back into the ring. Oh, big shot to the chest. And then a kick right to the side of the head. Johnny once again. Big stomp in the corner. But Reigns again fighting out the heart and determination of Roman Reigns. Is, oh, misses that kick, though. Roman Reigns again reversing. How many reversals does this man have? Jesus. Reigns, settle down. Uh, oh, Roman Reigns was going to set up for the spear, but Samoa Joe with the cheap shot from behind stuns Reigns, but maybe not enough as now Reigns. Oh, man, rolls through, keeps his hold again, and again rolls through, and a third suplex, dropping Johnny right on the back of his neck repeatedly. Now Reigns pulling him away from the ropes. Reigns taking a moment to catch his breath, try to find his second win, third win, fourth win. I don't know how many wins Roman Reigns has, but... And again, the back body drop sends Graves to the apron, though. He holds on. Oh, but a big right hand takes him the rest of the way to the floor. And again, Reigns going to taunt. Going to taunt. I'm not sure uh, I'm not sure how smart that is, but Reigns is going to do it in any case. Now goes out to the floor. Samoa Joe, though, dropping down from the apron. He's going to follow him out. Roman Reigns stomps away at Graves. Oh, and now lifts him. Oh, no. Whoa. Okay. I was going to say Samoa Joe saving Graves again, but Graves kind of fell on the back of his head awkwardly. I don't know. Graves might have a broken neck after that, but Graves, no, fighting back. And another shot to the ribs catches Reigns flush. And Reigns is down, and Graves is back into the ring. Now going to slide out, breaking up the referee's count once again. He lifts Reigns to his feet. Big shot to the stomach. Kick to the leg. What's he got in mind here? Oh, face buster right across the knee. Oh, and a super kick again. Again, he catches Reigns with a super kick. And now Joe, Johnny distracting the referee. And Joe is going to get his shots in. Brings Reigns back to the ring. Again, rolls him in. Clubbing blow to the chest. Kick to the side of the head. And how is Roman Reigns? Roman, there's no way in the world Roman Reigns can fight 
these odds. There's just no way he can fight these. All right. All right. His arms are purple. His arms are purple. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think purple is worse than red. Purple is worse than red, right? I think we're good. We can win this now. We can go ahead and win this match now. No. 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 Stop reversing, sir. Sir, I needed to break your arms, and now I need to beat you. So please stop reversing. Johnny Gray's reversal. Diving. Inverted DDT. And here we go. Here we go. Let's finish it. Finish it. Finish it. Uh-oh. What's Johnny got in mind here? Oh, big power bomb. One. Two. No, Reigns kicks out. Johnny transitions into a Boston Crab. Roman Reigns kicked out, and Gray's transitions it into a Boston Crab. Roman Reigns in the center of the ring. There's no ropes. There's no ropes, but Roman Reigns fights his way out. Wow, he escapes it. Oh, my God. Johnny Gray's finally going for the win, and Roman Reigns fighting his way out. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is it. Star killer for the third time. Hooks the leg. One, two, three. No! Roman Reigns kicks out. Roman Reigns kicks out. Johnny is pumped. Johnny is hype. And now the comeback. Taking Reigns down. Catches him. Rolls through. Oh, kick right to the ear. Reigns stumbles back into the corner. Oh, Reigns fighting out again. No, Johnny avoiding that one. Catches him. Backbreaker. Transitions right into the side Russian leg sweep. And again, getting Reigns back to his feet quickly. No! Reigns catches the super kick. Reigns catches the super kick. Rolls through. Lifts him up. And the sit-out powerbomb from Reigns. Oh, my God. Roman Reigns is Superman. Roman Reigns is Superman. Big back suplex. And now Reigns once again calling for the spear. Johnny Graves has no idea what's coming. Johnny reverses it. Johnny counters the spear into a DDT. Rolls him over. One, two, three. Johnny Graves and Samoa Joe defeat Roman Reigns. Four and a half stars. Match of the night candidate. Quite possibly match of the year candidate. Johnny Graves not once tagging in Samoa Joe. Although he did get saved several times by Samoa Joe. He never tagged him in. He fought Roman Reigns. He did everything he could to take the man down. Hit him with his finisher three times in this one. And at the end of the day, it took reversing the spear in order to get the win. It took converting the spear into a DDT to keep Roman Reigns down. What a match. What a fight. I don't think either of these men are going to be at 100% come money in the bank. Samoa Joe and Graves back in the backstage area. You were focused out there. I like that. If you don't slip up, I might make you my right-hand man. Hey, same here. What? Yeah, I might make you my right-hand man, Joe. Heh, <laughs> enjoy your weekend. I doubt Roman will be able to. I think you might be right, Mr. Samoa Joe, sir. Mr. Universal Champion, for the time being, keep my title warm, because I'll be coming for it. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to end the video here. This one is OD long. And I apologize for that. Anyway, thank you so much for checking out the video. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor. Hit that thumbs up. It would help me out a lot. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Be sure to hit the bell to turn on notifications. I'm out for now, but I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.